Oh no, I'm not gonna find her dress in time. Oh no, I'm gonna be the only one without a prom dress. No, I'm gonna have to wear the same dress I wore to eighth grade formal. <laughs> no. Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Cena. So today I'm going to be showing you footage of me buying a prom dress. I'm probably not gonna go to prom, and I'm probably not gonna get my payment back for prom. Um, because I don't know. That's just how it works, I guess. Apparently, um, I would like my hundred and fifty dollar deposit back, please. But that's not an option. So, um. Anywho, I'm not gonna cry about it because there's no point in that, and I already cried about it. So. I, instead, I'm going to show you footage of me buying a dress because I was going to post it. <laughs> this happened way before quarantine. This happened in February. I bought the dress. Let me say this. Your dress for prom does not have to be a lot of money. I paid $42 in tax for my dress and my prom shoes were $15. I might not even end up going to prom. And if I don't, I didn't spend a ton of money on a dress that I'll never get to wear. So that's exciting. Um, so let's pause the video. So the only place that I went to find a dress was Dillard's, the department store. I went two different times. The first time I went, there wasn't that many dresses, but the second time I went, there was more of a selection. So the first day at Dillard's, I tried this dress on, and I really liked the way it looked in the front, and my hips looked great. It didn't show my hip dips. I loved it. The issue with this one was my ass. I hated the way it looked. It literally squashed my butt. I am trying to show off at prom. I'm trying to show these little boys what they were missing all these years before I go off to college and get married and hitched, engaged to the love of my life of a man. So, I had to pop off. My butt had to look good. My wagon had to look plump because I've been working out all year, ladies. I was pressed for time. I also tried this one on. I was only trying on sale dresses because, again, I wanted to save some money. I liked this one, but I feel like the color was not it. And just one sudden wrong movement would expose everything. That little flap would be my only saving grace. It, and the slit was also really high and I didn't know how I was gonna be able to fix that. And I also did not love the sleeves and the dress was super itchy. I think it was like $30 though, or 15, something like A few weeks later, um, day two for shopping. I tried on a ton of dresses and let me tell you, there were so many dresses that were not I just hated them all and I wouldn't just, mm. and I was like, oh no, I'm not gonna find a dress in time. Oh no, I'm gonna be the only one without a prom dress. No, I'm gonna have to wear the same dress I wore to eighth grade formal. <laughs> No. Little did I know. The first one I tried on was this pink one. It was awful, literally terrible. It made me look pregnant. The slit was cute and had pockets, and I was like, oh, cute. Maybe this will be cute. It did not work, sis. It did not work. Then I just grabbed a whole bunch of dresses. I was like, F it. We're just going to try a bunch on and see what happens. I tried on this blue one, and again, it was terrible. The bottom was so tangled and poofy dresses just do not look good on me. I really like the back, but other than that, this dress was a flop and I think it was like $200. I tried this dress on and I really, really liked it. It was $120 and again, made my butt look great. I loved the halter neck and the slit was perfect. Like everything about this dress was great. I loved it, it went really well with my hair, but again, it was $120 and I had to really debate if I wanted to spend that much money on a dress. Next, I tried this one on, and I really liked it. It was $42 and some tax. Um, I had my Nike rooms on. I saw this damn lady would not stop knocking on my door while I was in the dressing room, even though I yelled busy twice. Oh my god, yes, Karen. Busy. Oh. Please ignore me. Um, I was also bloated that day because I'd eaten one too many Cheetos. But um, yes, this was the dress I tried and I put it on hold because I wanted to make sure I had mom's approval. 
came back later, tried the same dress on, and let me just say my booty is <laughs> banging in this dress. And this may or may not be the dress that I bought, but you know what? I'll reveal that later if I have a prom. And then for my prom shoes, I bought these little sparkly number um, $15 from DSW. I love DSW. Um, so much. Oh my god, please give me more discounts because I love buying your shoes and I love it even more. What? You're free. Okay. Um, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, I don't care. Okay? I don't care. Because I'm trying. I've been only out here for two freaking days. I'm trying. Okay? I'm sorry. Okay. But yeah, okay, I'm gonna go. Go to bed. Now.